President Obama gets sworn in for his second term. And what do all the American women think about that? They're more interested in Mrs. Obama's bangs. And for us Brits, that means her fringe. <laughs> It's another new shocker over the weekend. Zane from One Direction hasn't been faithful to his girlfriend Perry from Little Minx. Now Zane is a what, I don't know, 17, 18, 19 year old bloke who's in a boy band. Millions of pounds, fast cars, everything you can possibly imagine. At which point, you over-hormonal children, did you think that E is not going to start shagging everything that moves. I mean, girlfriend, he goes all around the world. He has groupies that come and spend an awful lot of time with him and they will happily open their legs to accommodate him. So at what point did you think that he would ever be faithful to a girl? I don't blame him. He's a teenage boy with girls throwing themselves at him. I think probably most teenage boys would do exactly the same as him. So these are the two girls, Perry and CJ. Now, which one would you choose? Would you choose Perry, who stood there going, geez, look at my cute giraffe, isn't it lovely? Or would you go for CJ, who's looking at you with eyes that say, come to bed? Hmm, it's not a difficult choice from where I'm standing. And to top it all, to make the whole story completely normal, not only did CJ sleep with him, but she woke up a little bit earlier than him and actually took a picture of him in bed next to her. Because that's what you do. That's completely normal. And even though you've said in the article, I don't really follow One Direction, and I don't really know who he is, you did feel the urge to actually take a picture of him just to prove that you did lie next to him in his bed. Now the girl that Zane has been nobbing is called CJ. Don't know what her full name is and actually don't really care. But as you can tell from these publicity shots, she's been keeping her head well below the parapet because she wants to stay out of the limelight and doesn't want to tell everyone about the fact that she took delivery of Zane's cock in the last few days. Katie Price is upset. Boo bloody who. She went and got married at a sandals resort. You may have seen some of those grotty pictures in the paper over the last few weeks. But she went and got married at a sandals resort with her new man. I still can't actually remember what his name is, but she's got married to him. Anyway, she's come home and now she's decided to say that sandals was a bit of a dump while she was there. And that the marquee she got married in was more like something you could buy in B&Q. And on her return, she also complained that one of the butlers that looked after her while she was there asked her, are you a porn star? And she's gone quite public about this and mentioned it in a few newspapers. And she believes that she should get her money back. To which Sandals has replied, as a gesture of goodwill, we are willing to offer her a refund on condition she does not choose us for any of her future weddings or stays. <laughs> man at Sandals is a genius, an absolute genius. I tell you, if you want to stick two fingers up at a celebrity, employ that man. He is fantastic. Absolutely brilliant. I still don't know what his name is, but it's very, very funny. <laughs>